Hi guys, welcome to my urban homestead. And here is Hubby with our pond uh, system build, our pond project. So honey, what are you doing? I just made a cage. Well, this is called a cage. And, and what is this, for? this is called a bell siphon. Uh huh. And here's the intake tube. What is it for? Uh, flood and drain. What are these brown things? Clay, clay pellets called hydroton. Oh, what are they for? Grow media, so we can put some uh, plants in there. Like hydroponics? Yes. Oh. And what's working underneath? What's that? I got a pre-pump filter there. What kind of pump is it? Uh, Tetra, 700 gallon, 700 gallons an hour. Uh, pond pump. How much is it? How much did it cost? Mm -hmm. Rob estimate. Six, $60, I think. $60, and the yeah. growing medium? Uh, I don't remember how much that cost. Mm -hmm. Got it from Home Depot. Online, there's a 50 pound bag, and somehow they gave me free shipping. Oh, cool. So, what are you going to do next? Fill it up. So, how does the system work? How does it work? Well, it fills up to the top of the intake pipe. And then it creates a siphon, mm -hmm. and it siphons it empty mm -hmm. to about a half an inch of water left in there. Mm -hmm. And uh, so it's called a flood and drain. It floods, mm -hmm. and then it drains. Oh. And um, it's aquaponics. You grow, grow plants with fish water. So when are you going to put the tilapias in there? Is it ready? Uh, maybe next week. Next week? Yeah, maybe. Why do you have to wait? I don't know. You don't know? Next week's, next week's just tomorrow. <laughs> oh yeah, it's June 1st tomorrow. So, okay guys, that's the update. <laughs> you want to see it work? Okay, go ahead, turn it on. I'm telling you guys, it's only like, it's not even first with the feeling, but it's good as it. Wow, look at that. And that's a berry plant. It needs to be tied up or it can grow here. I don't care. Oh, I'm going to tie it up on that thing. That's a goji berry. Looking good, honey. Okay, guys, so that's the update for our pond project. And they're going to keep you updated then once the tilapias are in it. Right, honey? Yep. Okay, bye. Bye, guys. See you again later. So how does it work? How does the system work? It well, sucks it's... water up and then goes in this reservoir and then go back down yeah and what about that one what's that for that's just uh extra water what do you mean extra water that's a pump pump more than i need for that the pump oh so it's uh i don't know what you call it but it's just another water car i guess oh. and what are you going to do what's that this here's uh, something I got since it's a brand new pond, mm -hmm. brand new filter, and the bio balls. What's that for? Uh, this is to make it ready for the fish. This is not paid that works sometimes. <laughs> no. Actually, this stuff's probably a waste of money. I don't know. But what's it supposed but, to do? 
BioStart for healthy water, eats pond sludge, stabilizes pH, reduces filter cleaning, and makes tap water safe. You're just gonna drop it in? Yeah, I'm just gonna drop it in here. Oh, like this? Ooh, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Fish. Hi guys, welcome to my urban homestead. We are now getting ready to release some tilapias from our aquarium. We are ready to put them in their new room. It's a momentous event. <laughs> The breeze feels really good. Seven right now. There's more in the house still. So there's a bunch of first guy. And what do we do with our fish water? Go fertilize my plants. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm taking the ones over there. Lilacs. Okay, and put some on the lamping cherry. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'll show you again once we're all done. Okay, there's some more coming. <laughs> Good thing these ain't catfish. <laughs> this will be the permanent home until it's time for us to harvest them. Oh. Jumpers, and that's why I kept the water level low. Mm -hmm. They can't jump out. What I tell ya, that one just jumped out of this bucket. This needs to hurry up. I'm glad it didn't go in the hole. Honey, I don't use a net. 
as much as I don't have to. Mm -hmm. Well, they're in a hurry, though. <laughs> it's supposed to have, as I was saying, it's supposed to have the rest of the bacon heat. So this needs to be done now. She can still <laughs> handle the heat. She might end up having handle it because I'm tired of it. Yeah, the temperature in this tank here is 72, mm -hmm. and the tank I just took them out of is uh, 70. Are you done? That's it. That's it. Okay. That's it for that tank. Okay. The other tank is still too warm. We still have. Uh, one more tank in the house with the, this size, this size is proper, and we have, we have one tank in the house with this size of tilapia, mm -hmm. and the babies from last year, huh? two tanks in the garage yeah. with uh, pretty much bigger, yeah. about double, up, double this size. You might end up harvesting those. Uh, I'm uh, thinking about <laughs> building a bigger pond for uh, some yeah. of the smaller ones. We're going to build another pond in that spot. But yeah, that's the update for our aquaponics. We're, we'll be planting some vegetables on top of here. But we'll see. Just a little bit of a pond. <laughs> okay. Thank you, guys. Hit like and subscribe. See you again in the next update. Bye. God bless.